Welcome back fellow coders, Jared O'Leary here with Boot Up. In this video, I'm gonna show you how the coder resources are changing for Scratch 3.0. So you may be concerned and be like, oh no, Scratch is changing. So it's updating to 3.0. And what does this mean for all the stuff that is on Boot Up's website? You may notice that this has the older blocks and everything looks nice and neat, but ta-da, there's another version that I've been working on in the background that you will see on January 2nd that has all the same stuff updated with the new blocks. So for instance, how to draw a square, while the code used to look like this in the old version of Scratch, in the new version of Scratch, here are the new blocks. So everything's going to update. Now, in addition though, I have added some new stuff. So if you see slide two right here is talking about drawing the shapes, but that doesn't occur until slide five. The reason why is because I've added in some things that shows you how to like open the extensions to click on the pin tab and then yay, we got some new blocks. Woohoo! So don't worry, all of these stuff is gonna update with Scratch 3.0, including all the videos, and it's going to um, include some new resources in here that show you some stuff that you can do with the 3.0 update that you could not do in the old version of Scratch. Hey everyone, if you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. If you're not watching us on YouTube, you can find us on that platform as well as other social media outlets by searching for Boot Up PD. And if you're looking for more free lessons, projects, and resources for teachers and students, visit us at bootuppd.org, where you can also learn about our high-quality professional development.